Hi, my name is Kathy Neubauer. I'm a model, actress, dancer, and a makeup artist. The purpose of this project is to really bring an idea that I have in mind of some sort of creature and bring it to life using various types of makeup, um, airbrushing, and also creating prosthetics for my model, Reggie Russell. Um, I am also going to be working with Octavio Lopez, who will be directing and filming the whole thing. So can't wait to see it, can't wait to work on it, and enjoy. Day one will be our day where we will be taking measurements of my model and creating the mold, then casting. And after that, we will be applying the liquid latex on the cast and we'll wait till day two, which will be painting the prosthetics. This is phase one and I am creating the mold for my model. How this all started, well, Mr. Octavio Lopez himself called me and, you know, he just asked me, he's like, you know, you want to do a you know, small video of just the process of making prosthetics and just, you know, makeup and just creating a, some sort of creature. I was on board when he told me that. I was like, yeah, I'll do it, you know? So I sent him over some sketches, some ideas. He actually sent me some ideas of his, uh, for himself too. And we collaborated. And I mean, literally like three days later, we're shooting right now, you know? So it was a joint effort. Um, and I'm really excited and glad and thankful that he, you know, came to me and asked me to do something like this. So I really want to, you know, get this out there and really show how long the process is and just how, you know, how tedious it can be. I love it. It's very therapeutical for me. So, and I, you know, I love having a thought or an idea in my head and just bringing it to life. So I feel like with this here, you'll be able to see that. Moving the piece, and you see how we have the clay that we were working with earlier. Um, the molding, and now we have our cast. Voila. Now we have our piece. So I have my water. Make sure we clean that up. overnight let it dry for a bit and then our prosthetic piece made out of liquid latex should be ready day one went by went really well we worked on the horns that will be placed on the back of my creature well on the back of Reggie also what we did today was created the face that will be applied to my model's face. I'm really excited to see how that would look on my model once it's all painted and all done up. That's going to be really good. A lot of painting will be going on on day two. Lots of colors. And for day three, I will bring in my lovely assistant, Bessie. Uh, she is actually my sister, so she'll be helping me out with the process of application for the, the prosthetics. Alright, day three is going to be application day. 
which is going to be the, I guess for me, the fun part, because you get to see all, you know, your hard work and all the days that went by of putting something together and just making it come alive. That's the day that you'll be able to see that. All the pieces will be pre-painted. The reason why I have it pre-painted is so that, one, because of time, two, you know, you're not having your model sit in the position for hours and hours while trying to paint the prosthetic piece on them. That's why I'm having them pre-painted on day two. Day three is application where we'll be applying all the pieces on his face, on his back. We're gonna do some airbrushing on his arms, neck. He'll be wearing a skull cap. I'm really excited to see the end result and how all the pieces will just come together and flow. And uh, so my model, Reggie, and I know that Octavio is really excited to see the end process. After the application process, we will be shooting a short film with the characters. When I say characters, um, it's not only going to be Reggie, I will also be playing a part in it too. Just a small segment, you're just going to have to wait. I met Octavio through um, actually my dance director, George Alvarez, so that's how I met Octavio Lopez. So ever since then, it just has been like just a domino effect where we just kept on working together, we do projects here and there, and I really enjoyed it. So this is just another one of them. There you go, it is the icing on the cake. This is a story where love turns into fear in Inglewood, Southside of Chicago. The year is 1977, and blood is sought out from an outcast for being something different.